Welcome back to Arise and Shine. Alicia Slick Ashley is a four-time world champion boxer who currently competes in the super bantam weight division. She is here with us today to discuss her career and what it's like to compete as a woman in a predominantly male sport. Welcome, Alicia. Welcome. Thank now, Thank Alicia, you. just looking at you, you're so petite, but you can kick my butt. Well, I sure can, can, yes. What inspired you to get into boxing? Well, um, that's a roundabout story. I actually started out as a dancer. My father is a dancer. Dancer, and that was my goal. I was going to become yeah. a professional dancer. Mm -hmm. I went to college for dance. I got um, scholarships to Alvin Ailey and Martha Graham. Yeah. And uh, while I was dancing, I uh, tore my meniscus. And my oldest brother, Devon, at the same time growing up, was into karate. And he's the one that been trying to get me into karate mm -hmm. for yeah. the longest. And he got me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just needed something to do. I right. was this athlete from day one so right. um i got into karate and kickboxing and then uh boxing, boxing. so he's the driving force be behind now, that i know you have so many accolades but <laughs> tell us about the belts and championships you've won i've won four uh, world title belts oh, wow. no big deal wow. <laughs> <laughs> i should be afraid of you <laughs> uh, uh the iwbf uh at the uh, at featherweight yeah and then i dropped weight and fought at uh junior featherweight, super bantamweight, and won that one again, uh, IWBF again, and then I won a GBU at, which is Global Boxing Union, at uh, 118, which is bantamweight. Okay. And I currently fight at uh, super bantamweight, which is 122, and I won the WBC, which is one of the one of the primo. Wow. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, and you have great. you brought your belt so, yes. with you I today know. and you're matching your belt, which is so <laughs> Thank cool. You. Yeah. <laughs> so you've had moderate success, I would say. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but you come from a family of champions, and we yes. recently interviewed your brother, Maurice, who is also a grand master in chess. Yes. Um, would you liken boxing to chess? Yes, I, I definitely do. Uh, we're a very competitive family. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I <so>. can tell. <laughs> um, but for me, uh, boxing is just like a chess match. Mm -hmm. You're pitting yourself against another opponent, and your goal is to move this person around like a chess piece to the mm -hmm. right position so that you can hit them. Knock them out. So, <laughs> <laughs> you say it so nice, so you can hit them. So you you want to knock them out. <laughs> but I also, uh, because of my dancing, I do equate it to dances. It's more like that uh, pas de deux where it, you're in unison and you're contrasting. So there's a beauty to the sport. Right. Well, and so, and I know that you've said before that boxing is not as brutal of a sport as some people might think. I mean, can you tell me about well, that? Well, I thought it was brutal when I was growing <laughs> up. Uh, right. I, I actually did not like watching boxing until I became a boxer. Okay. Until I got into the sport and mm -hmm. could understand the nuances of the sport, which is why I really, um, you know, for me, it's more the strategic part of it. Mm -hmm. It's more a mental game right. than that physical game. I think anyone that with physio physicality can get into the sport, mm -hmm. but it's how strong you are mentally that yeah. can keep you in that game. And I don't think a lot of people yeah. realize that. Now, you brought the WBC belt. Yeah. Tell us about it. I mean, it's gorgeous. Look at it. Yeah, it has, like, all of the With flags. The photo too. Yeah. <laughs> Where do Tell you keep this that. in your house? It's actually in my office at the gym. Oh, nice. yeah. oh wow. So, okay. so um, I mean, what was that match like? What do you remember about it? Well, th this actually was up in the Bronx, and uh, it was outdoors, so, and I'm originally oh, wow. Jamaican, so I love the hot weather. It was yeah. in the middle of the summer. Oh, boy. Um, and the girl was pretty tough, Christina Ruiz. Mm -hmm. She was out of uh, New Mexico. And um, I just remember that uh, I punched her a lot. Because <laughs> my, my knuckles hurt a lot after it was swollen. But for me, it... it it was such an achievement because it, this for me is like the pinnacle. Yeah. Right. And I really wanted this belt. Now, let's get some technicalities out of the way here. Mm -hmm. Now, in 2014, Forbes list uh, said that in the highest paid athletes reported Floyd Ma money, you know, <laughs> yeah. money, money Mayweather. Mayweather. Yes. He's making $30 million wow. for a fight. Yes. You know, what do you usually make as a woman? Well, here in the USA, um, for a title fight, mm -hmm. it might be 5,000. Wow. For the WBC that I fought in the Bronx was 3,000. 
And I don't expect to make Mayweather type money. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very few men right, also even make, make that kind of money. Mayweather right. type yeah. money. But for the females, um, you would hope as a world champion, you're making a lot more. Absolutely. Yeah. And the I one mean, thing also about that is that a lot of promoters will say that uh, the women aren't making that amount of money because one, we fight two minute rounds instead of three minute rounds. Mm -hmm. So one big thing I say is that, okay, pay us by the minute. Right. Now, if a world champion fighter male is making a half a million dollars, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, divide that by 30 right. exactly. and you get about 16,000 or so right. and then multiply it by 20 and I'll get $300,000. Yeah. Right. So if, if it's that sense, you, you know, I don't expect Yeah, to that's not a logical right. argument really. So um, for us, it's just, you guys are not uh, stepping up to the plate. Right. Yeah. And you actually have to even have a second job, right? To No, I have a first job. Okay. My first <laughs> job is a trainer. Okay. <laughs> this is my second job because I can't, I can't uh, live on what I'm making mm -hmm. as a world champion yeah. from my fights. And so, in, in your opinion, by the way, why is there such a huge discrepancy between male and female boxers? I know it's not like that everywhere in the world, right? Well, it's not just boxing that there's a huge discrepancy in the pace mm -hmm. for, you know, for athletes, and not just athletes in general, but um, the only athletes that are making the same amount as a male on on the, you know, at the top right. is uh, tennis. Okay. And for the world, you know, U.S. Open, Wimbledon, the women in the, uh, at the finals make the exact same and amount. That, and that yeah. was just very recently that exactly, that happened. Exactly, yeah. exactly. And the women are doing uh, three sets in that five. Right. Yeah. So you can't say, okay, right, okay. two minute, three minute rounds. Right. It's the same, you know, it's the same thing. But, um, I'm very surprised in the USA that we're going back. Mm -hmm. You know, I go away all the time to fight. I don't mm -hmm. fight in the USA because of that. Mm -hmm. yeah. If I'm here, I have to sell my own tickets. Mm -hmm. I have to sell my opponent's tickets Whoa. because they're coming from someplace else. That so sounds I have to ridiculous. cover their pay right. and you know, their expenses because they're putting up at hotels and all of that. Yeah. So, um, so I go away all the time to fight. Why do I have to worry about all of that? Where have you yeah. been? I fought in... Um, uh, Argentina, Mexico, oh, wow. Panama, Germany, Austria, North Korea. Oh, <laughs> oh <boy. laughs> I was just talking about Korea earlier yes. in the show. <laughs> China, you know, yeah. so I've gone around the world and fought. That's amazing. And, and the minimum amount I get when I'm around the world is, would be fifteen, twenty thousand dollars $20,000. My last fight in Mexico, mm -hmm. I made $30,000, and that was, you know, yeah. whoopee. Right. <laughs> so what advice would you give to novice female boxers? Well, the one big thing about it is that um, you're not going in, you can't go into the sport expecting um, to get self-esteem from it. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to go into it and have that, because one of the big things about it is, is that they're not going to give it to you. Mm -hmm. uh, you don't expect to get... You know, I wish I'm I'm still around this length of time. Yeah. Because I was hoping that I would be able to make something. Right. But you can't go in there expecting that, especially for boxing. Right. Um, but uh, you know, you go in there, you enjoy it. I really do. I I I, I tell I tell my nephews all the time I don't play at boxing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They want it's not a game. No. You get hurt in this sport. Yeah. It's, it, if you don't, um, you can't go in and say, okay, uh, don't feel so well today. I'm going right. to go spar. Yeah. No. Because <laughs> you're going to get hit. Every day. You know, you, you really, ha up. it has to be a focus. So yeah. you go, I, go into the sport. You know, there, there are a lot more women in the sport than when I first stepped in. Which is great. So yeah. uh, I, I totally love seeing women in, in the gym. That's awesome. Well, oh, you're such great. an inspiration yeah. to you're young You're going to teach us women. some boxing moves, right? Before uh, yeah, I know. No, no, I, gonna, I, how I, do yeah. you do it? What's, what's, the, what's the pose? <laughs> yeah, <I'll> pose. <laughs> yeah, it's not a pose, Sean. I know, I know. Like, whatever. Well, very sage advice, and hopefully discussions like this will help to bridge the gap between men and women in boxing. You're a true inspiration, Alicia. Thank you thank so you. much for being with us today. For more on Alicia, follow her on Facebook and Instagram at Alicia uh, Slick Ashley. You all may have noticed that I have a new hairstyle. Well, Idris <laughs> Nichols, celebrity hairstylist, gave me this new look that I love. She's with us today with some great holiday hair tips. We'll be right back with more Arise and Shine.